Tonight on 60 Minutes, the rise of labor unions. A union is an organization established by and for workers to pursue collective workplace goals, such as wages, benefits, work rules, and power. In the United States, children were used as workers because of their size, and they could be paid much less than adults because of the lack of enforced worker laws. This all changed after the National Child Labor Committee was organized in 1904. I don't know what I've been told. I don't know what I've been told. Working this hard is getting old. Working this hard is getting old. All I want to do is play. All I want to do is play. In this factory I will not say. In this factory I will not say. Let's all thank our union men. Let's all thank our union men. A helping hand they all did lend. A helping hand they all did lend. Let's go union. Let's go union. Let's go union. Unions gained fair laws for workers using various techniques. One very effective way was a strike. At General Motors in the 1930s, we had a sit-down strike. They hired lip readers to see if Union ever crossed our lips. If it did, we would be fired on the spot. The word Union scared employers. They knew once one was formed, they no longer had slaves but employees. The first formal Union, the American Federation of Labor, was formed in 1886. Thanks to the rise of labor unions, workers now have many benefits they wouldn't have had prior to their existence. In 1903, the Teamsters Union was formed. It undoubtedly became one of the fastest growing labor organizations. Unions, such as the Teamsters, are responsible for paid vacations, workplace safety standards, social security, child labor laws, and sick and maternity leave. I always had enough food on the table and clothes on our backs because my mom was a union high school teacher. So this fight for me is very, very personal. It is my belief that the future of the rights of working people in this country will not be decided in Congress. It will not be decided in the courts. It will not be decided on talk radio. It will not be decided on Fox News. Chuck from Chicago, and a man walks up and said, This is a union town, a union town.